Today I thought I'd come at you with a anti-Valentine's Day look. I already have two Valentine's Day looks up on my channel, but I wanted to kind of switch it up and do more of a Valentine's Day look for all of the Valentine's Day hating people. And I also really, really like black lipstick and I missed it and I wanted an excuse to wear it. So that's why. So I did this. And this is super appropriate for today because it is freezing rain outside and I had to walk down the sidewalk and I almost died. But I was like, no, I can't die. I must do this tutorial. So if you guys want to know how to get this anti-Valentine's Day look, then just keep on watching. I'm so hungry. You guys want some popcorn? I have a, I have a really big bag of popcorn. <laughs> okay guys, so I'm going to get started. The first thing I'm going to do is prime my eyes with some concealer. And we are going to do this so that this red eyeshadow really shows up on our skin. So I'm going to grab my Modern Renaissance palette because what else would I grab? Do you know what channel you're on? <laughs> I'm going to be taking Burnt Orange and I'm just going to start that as a little bit of a transition color and then we're gonna just ju like jump right into the red so it's gonna be really fast then I'm gonna dip right into a Venetian red which is this red right here and we're gonna start in the outer V and the crease and then make our way inwards this is fucking intense I like it. Now I'm going to take Flame Thrower by Makeup Geek on a wet brush and I'm going to put that on my lid. Then I'm going to take my Rimmel Scandal Eyes. I'm pretty sure this is actually an eyeshadow, but I just use it as eyeliner all the time, so it's really going to give us that raccoon look that we're looking for today. This just looks crazy without lashes. So we're going to put on some lashes. So I'm just going to pop on my Huda Beauty lashes very quickly. You can't tell if these are Farrah or Sasha lashes. They kind of look like Farrah's. So now you've got your massive lashes on so you can fly away from all of the Valentine's Day bullshit. So lately I like to prep with my MAC Fix Plus. I'll just do a little spritz spritz before I put on my foundation. And the foundation that I have been using over the last couple of days is the NARS All Day Luminous Foundation. And this is in the color Macau. And I've been really liking this foundation so far. So this is definitely a all day full coverage foundation so if you're looking for something like that then definitely check out this foundation for my highlighter i'm going to be using the Too faced born this way concealer this is the same concealer that i used on my eyelids as you guys can tell i'm going for a super bright highlight today you gotta blend your ex on valentine's day boo -boo. and we're gonna grab our handy dandy laura mercier powder in order to avoid creasing I am the ghost of Valentine's Day past. I'm pretty sure there's powder in my eye. Pretty sure. Now I'm gonna contour with my Stila Contour Kit. Cut them cheekbones, girl. Cut it. And I'm gonna grab some more powder and just clean up the contour a little bit. And while we are waiting for this to set, we're going to smoke out the bottom lash line with some black eyeshadow. I want this look to be really bright, so I am gonna be taking the Anastasia Glow Kit and we're gonna go into a Moonstone and maybe let's mix it with a little bit of Tourmaline too. So we're mixing these two colors together and using that as our highlight. That is bright. We gon' blind these bitches. I love when highlighter is almost like wet. Now I'm gonna seal this all together with some Fix Plus. And I'm gonna be topping this all off with some black lipstick to match my dark soul. So that's it guys, that is it for this anti-Valentine's Day tutorial. If you guys enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel because I make two videos a week and you don't want to miss that. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!